Hi, this is A Minute of Overpass. My name is Eric and I make apps. Now this week I want to talk about what are you going to do when it all ends? Okay, so quite a lot of people comment about their accounts being suspended from Google Play. So Google Play just shutting them down. Right? And it's something that scares me a lot. And in a few weeks ago, somebody was asking me about it. They were saying that they have two strikes against them and you, you're allowed to have three. And uh, you know, and what will you do if, if uh, Google Play shuts you down and all this kind of stuff. And it's something that I actually think about all the time, right? I'm, I'm terrified of Google Play shutting down my account because everything's in there because I've worked so hard of building that up, you know, the, the, you know, the millions and millions of downloads. And, and you know, I'm not doing anything wrong. I mean, when I talk to people about this, they go, well, why would they shut you down? You're not doing anything wrong. And I said, I know, but I've got like three strikes against me already. I don't know how many you're supposed to have. So I'll, I'll tell, you, tell you about one of them, which wasn't that bad. Uh, and, uh, you know, and then and we'll go on from there. So if you have a look at my screen here, this is an app uh, which was just a reskin, like purchasing the code and reskinning it. This is the only time I've ever done this, and it's the last time I will ever do it. I've done a video about this before, so I won't go to, to it too much. But we we purchased the code for a, a swing copter clone, and my designer went through and made it all spy based because we thought we could, you know, appeal it to like ear spy um, uh, users and everything like that. You know, go with the whole spy theme and everything. So you know, we worked quite a lot on this, and uh, and we released it. Uh, and Apple approved it. You know, it makes me no money. I think I don't even think we have AdMob in it. We have RebMob in it. So I make like, I think I make one cent every two weeks or something on this thing. It's it's ridiculous. But I mean, it was approved by Apple. I mean, it went through Google as well. But this is what I got. Suspended. I got it suspended almost immediately. And the reason they said was because it was trying to imitate another app. And this was the kind of thing where I I maybe I should have appealed it. I mean, this was a few years ago uh, because other people are doing it. If you go to like these uh, these reskin websites or whatever, they'll tell you all you have to do is change the graphics and release it as your own. And, you know, it was the kind of thing where, you know, it's the only time I've ever done it. I kind of didn't feel right about it. And then once I released it and then it was suspended, I said, that's the last time I'm ever going to ever going to do that. But this is the kind of thing which scares me about Google Play is 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 doing something that is not that bad. It's, you know, and, and you, you having something completely suspended. Now, I two my two other strikes here are let me just go back here. Um, Alarm Spy and iSpy. So so our big app is called, you know, Ear Spy. So I thought we would have a companion site called iSpy. And uh, what that was is it, it takes a ca camera in your phone and it uses it as a web server and you can't use it like remotely. You can only use it uh, like within your Wi-Fi network. You put it in another room and then you just you, you the browser connects to it and it takes a picture. So it was it wasn't wasn't that bad, but it was removed. And the reason they said they removed it was because it had malware or harmful code in it. Right. And I did appeal this one because I said I'm not malware, but part of me was thinking it is a creepy app. Right. It was. You know, when I thought about it, it was doing really, really well, but it was kind of creepy. Now, if you have a look at this, uh, and one of the reasons why I think it may have been uh, something with an ad network, because back then I was adding every ad network that was available, trying to see which ones was best. You see the paid version here is still published. They never done anything with a paid version. So people still buy this quite a lot. Um, and, uh, you know, so yeah, it's it's kind of thing where you know this one and the alarm spy was same kind of thing. It was a motion sensor. It sends you an email if it sees any movement in your house and stuff like that. So, so those three of them are my three strikes, and they scare me a lot because you think, what if I release something else and I have an ad network? And the ad networks are the code that you cannot control. You don't know what they're going to add in there. And this again, it goes back to my love of ad, ad mob because that's the only way. Like I trust ad mob. Uh, I'm using AdMob, AppLovin, and uh, right now I'm using Facebook Audience Network, uh, and everything else is using a through um, uh, mediation, having other things go through there and see how those do. Uh, but uh, but those are the things. So that it starts to make me think that yes, maybe one day I could get my account suspended because I don't really really know very much about it. If you look at the help on this, which when they have these uh, suspensions, they talk about. Every suspension counts as a strike against the good standing of your Google Play developer account uh, and multiple policy violations can result in suspension, right? So this, um, you know, 
the good standing, that's what kind of bothers I don't know how many strikes you're allowed or anything like that. So if anybody has had their account suspended, uh, if you could put like a reason why, you could do it anonymously. I don't know if you do it anonymously uh, and just kind of let us know because this is something that, that um, you know, is really interesting to me. So anyway, we go back to you know, what will happen if, if everything, you know, what will happen when everything ends essentially. And aside from being embarrassed about the fact that I have so many you know, YouTube videos out there about app development, um, it won't affect me very much. I mean, it's, you know, every industry changes and everybody goes through these kind of things. I mean, when I became an app developer, I left a very good job uh, to, and everyone was saying that, you know, you're crazy to do it. And, uh, you know, and then, you know, eventually they end up, well, they end up ma being made redundant or I worked at companies where everyone thought their jobs were secure. And then, you know, six months later, they're carrying boxes out of the building long after you've left. Uh, and you know every industry is on the move. Everybody has to you know, assume that this is not going to be here six months from now, a month from now, or whatever. And this is one of the problems with uh, with app income. And I love app income. I love the fact that it comes in even when I'm on holiday. It comes in when I'm sleeping. All this kind of stuff, as opposed to client work, which we obviously work for. The nice thing about that is it's coming in. the The, the downside is. Is you don't it's not really that predictable I mean you could um, you, you keep promoting things but you know everything can dry up tomorrow and then you know you, you'll be back where you started so you're always preparing for that rainy day so I'm not too worried about my account being suspended I mean it will be a pain because I'll have to go back and you know do some more client work and stuff like that uh, and uh, but you know it's, it's a thing you know, we I think when it comes to the justice of the Google Play system I don't have a lot of faith in it I mean, I suppose I should, but it seems more automated than with Apple. If Apple sees a problem with your app, they will tell you about it and they will let you fix it. Google will suspend it. And if I go back to this uh, suspension page over here, I go into one of these. It just, it doesn't let you do anything. It doesn't let you amend it. It doesn't let you resubmit it. It doesn't let you even delete it. So it's just this thing that sits in your, in your uh, app list. So. So anyway, that's it for this week. I'm ending on a dark note, but uh, <laughs> thing, but the, 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 you know, the surprising thing is, even though I've been thinking about this for the past few weeks, uh, you know, is that everything's going really well. I mean, more income's coming in than ever has before. Uh, things are going well, but even when I was working, when my job was totally secure, I was always thinking about what, was, what's, what am I gonna do when this ends? And uh, you know, always knowing, you know, even when you're on a, on a boat, you know where the lifeboat is. So. Anyway, that's it for this week, rambling. I'll talk to you next week. All right, bye.